Hello, Sunny. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hi. How was your weekend? How was your, how was your weekend, Sunny? Wow, that's really nice, Sunny. Okay, what's the weather today? It's sun. Oh, that's great. It's similar here in my place. Okay, so today, Sunny, have you eaten dinner yet? Yes. Wow, that's very good. You had dinner a bit early because it's just 7 o'clock in Vietnam, right? Yes. Yes, what time did you have dinner, Sunny? I have egg and beef and some rice. Very good. That's perfect. Ca a little carbs and some protein. Okay, so what time did you have dinner? It's six o'clock. Wow, very early. <laughs> Well, that's good for you because me, I haven't eaten my dinner yet. I just finished working out. Do you exercise, Sunny? Yes. Wow. How do you exercise? I can stretch and I can play with a dice with my friend. Very good. Okay, that's great, Sunny. So, Sunny, I want you to look at the picture. I'm going to ask you a question and you answer in a complete sentence. Let's have a warm up. Look at the picture. What can you see here? Mm -hmm. I can see a girl is playing a dice and the boy is is mm, mm, is cutting the dice. That's right. So they're playing a board game. So this game is what we call snake and oh. ladder. Do you know how to play this game? Uh. Uh, no. Oh, okay. This is very easy. As you can see in here, there are boxes. Each box says has a number. Okay. Yeah. For example, you're going to roll the dice. Da -da 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 -da. Then the roll the dice will yeah. fall on the ground. If it's two, that means you're going to move to one, two. Wow, there's a ladder. So let's go up in here. Okay, for example, if oh. your snake is uh, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh no, there's a snake. You have to fall again right here. <laughs> so the higher you got to the finish line, oh. then that means uh, the quicker you got to the finish line, then that means you are the winner. That's how snake and ladder is played on. Okay. But don't worry because we're not going to play that game. <laughs> okay. So we're just going to have a question and answer. Okay. Look. What's in the box, Sunny? The box. It has... His number. Very good. <laughs> okay, so on this board game, the box says has numbers, just like what I told you. Very good. Can you see any other box in this room? Mm. Yes. That's right. Look, there's something inside that box. What is it? The robot is in the box. 
Very good, Sunny. How many snakes can you see in the picture? Oh, I see three snakes. Very good. What color is the longest snake? Longest snake. Hmm. Hmm. Longest snake is a red snake. I mean, look at what they're playing. What color is the longest snake? It's the. It's the red snake. Very good. Okay, look. Someone smiling between the children. Who is it? It's a boy. Look carefully. There's someone in this room that is sitting near the window and between the children. And it is smiling. Who is it? Oh, it has three teeth. Say that again. The monster has three teeth. Yes, it's the monster. Great, Sunny. Now this time, Sunny, you will be the one to ask me questions. You can follow the question in here or you can actually make your own questions according to the picture. All right? Okay. Mm. Of course, smiling. Yes, she's smiling at the boy. Oh, wait Where's a minute. We're going to switch. You will be the one to ask me a question, and I will answer your question. Okay? Okay. Very good. How many snakes can you see? I can see three snakes. Do you see the thing that is purple is near the window? Yes, I do. And it has got three teeth and four legs. Oh, what is that? Two. It's a monster. Can you see the box? But it's not a box. But it's near the goal. Mm -hmm. Do you mean the house? Yes. Yes, it's a house. How oh. many windows are there in the house, Sunny? There are one windows. Very good. Give me a high five, Sunny. Wow, great. That's nice because you know how to ask questions. Great, Sunny. So for that, you've got one, two, three stars. Okay, now let's look at this one. So this time, you're going to ask Teacher AM about the object and you're going to, we're going to exchange later. For example, put the ball under the books. Where is the ball? Is there a ball under the books? Is there a ball in here? No. So this time we're going to draw a ball. Put the ball under the books. So if you say put the ball under the books, then I'm going to draw a ball in here. Okay? Okay. Great. So that is only an example, Sunny. So look and tell me to draw things in this picture. You can do it. Mm -hmm. Put the robot in the box. Put the, put no, the me robot. first. 
so that you'll have an idea. Look at the robot. It's in the box. I want you to draw a car on the box. Wow, nice, sunny. Great. Okay. Can you see the clock? It says three o'clock. I want you to draw a picture between the window and the clock. Listen carefully. Okay. Can you see the clock? It says three o'clock. Draw a picture of a family between the window and the clock. Very good. Nice, okay. Sunny. Okay, last one. I want a doll in this picture. Put the doll in front of the house. In front. In front. Oh, yeah. Right. In front. Mm. In front. Ah. Isa. Okay, try again, Sunny. Listen carefully. Can you see the doll house? I want a yes. doll in this picture. Draw a doll oh. in front of the doll house. In front. Is the... All right. Right here. When we say in front, that means in the front. <laughs> okay, this one is what we call next to or beside. Okay. So for this one, you've got another one, two, one and two stars. Now this time, Sunny, it's your turn to tell me what to draw in the picture. Okay, by using in front of, on, in, under, next to, or above. You can do it, Sunny. <laughs> What will you say? Oh, ah. No. What will you say, Sunny? Uh, 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 uh. Oh, wait uh, a minute. Tell me an instruction so that I can draw something in the picture. Just like what I did to you when I said... Draw a picture between the window and the clock. Then you draw. So this time, you will be the one to tell me what to do. And I will draw. Okay? Okay. Great. You can do it. Put 
Tomaso, Apu Tomaso, Apu Tomaso, on the bookcase. It's right here. <laughs> it's right. <laughs> uh, Very good. I think it's a I monkey. It's a monkey. <laughs> I don't know how to draw a monster. <laughs> okay, but that will do. So you've got one star for that. Great, Sunny. Okay. So this time, Sunny, let's move on from that. So tell me about the people in your family. Okay. What color is your dad's hair? It's black. Wow, nice. Okay. What about his eyes? What color are his eyes? It's brown. And black. Very good. What about mommy? What color is her hair? Uh, mm, it's pink. Oh, really? Pink? Like yes. this one? Like this? Um, uh, it's, it's not. Like oh, it's princess. probably red. Ah, okay. Oh, that looks unique. Okay, so Sunny, what do your parents like to do? My mom likes to play volleyball and my dad likes to play Nice. Very good. Nice, Sunny. Okay, so great job for that. So I'm going to give you another three stars. Very good. But instead of saying, my dad like play tennis, okay, we don't say it like this, but we say it, my dad likes to play tennis. Can you please read this one, Sunny? Then I play tennis. And Very my good. dad loves to play tennis. That's right. Very good. Okay. Now, what about your sister? What does she like to do? She likes Playing people. And his hair is black. Say that again, please. My sister likes to play basketball and his hair is black. Very good. Wow. Okay. Is your sister a girl or a boy? A girl. Of course. Since it is a girl, what are we going to use? His or her? His or her. 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 Very good. So what will you say? Can you say it again? My sister likes to play basketball and... And her hair is black. And her hair is black. And her hair is black. Nice. Very good, Sunny. What about you? What sport do you like to do? Hmm. I love volleyball. Wow, very good, Sunny. Okay, 
Now, look at this. We are now in Unit 11 in the street. Wow, look at this street. There are many people in the street. It's probably in the city because I can see a plane. So this time, Sunny, I want you to look at this beautiful street that's near the beach. Okay, now look and tell me the number of the picture. There is one example. Where is the mo What number is the motorbike here? Motorbike is eight. The car number is eight. eight. Very good. The what car? about the car? Okay, I can tell you. Oh no. What about a helicopter? Oh, no, no. I can do this. Okay. Very good. Nice, Sunny. Helicopter? I don't know how to counter. Hmm. What? You don't know how to? Hmm? Don't worry, because I'm going to delete this one. Great. Wow, a helicopter's number four. What about the bus? What number's the bus in the picture? Okay, seven. That's right. How about a train? What number is the train? Very good. What about a bike? Press bike. Ah, nine. Nice, you found it. How about a lorry? Um, wow, great, Sunny. Sheep. Nice, a plane. Yeah. Wow, well done, Sunny. Give me a high five, Sunny. Very good. You're so smart. You already know all the words in here. So I'm going to give you another three stars for that. Okay. Now, Sunny, look at the words below. What can you think of all these words? What are these? These are what we call... Yeah. Are they clothes? No. Are they no. animals? No. Very good. What do we call them? Mm. Well, they are... Uh, they are what we call vehicles or different types of Transportation. Can you please say transportation? Transportation. Very good. A transportation is a thing that we use so that we can move from one place to another. For example, I want to go to another city. How can I go to Ho Chi Minh from Hanoi? Hanoi is a plane. That's right. So I have to fly a plane. Shh. I am now in Ho Chi Minh City. Okay. So I want to go to the supermarket from your place. What can I ride or what can I take? Ah, uh, it's a car. What's that? It's a car. Very good. So through that, we use a transportation so that we can go oh. in one place. Okay, how do you go to school, Sunny? Hmm. I ride my family. I need to go a uh, car. Wow, you go to school by car. Great. How do you go to the market? Market is 
got a bus. Through the bus. I, I mean, by a bus. Very good. Okay, where do you go with your bicycle? I can ride my bike in five o'clock. Very good. To the park. Very good, Sunny. Okay, so well done for that, Sunny. So this time, let's look and write the words. There is one example. Look, look, we have open because this, the motorbike store is open. What about number two? And no. What do you mean, no? You can choose the words in here. We have new, closed, and angry. Oh. He? Oh. Uh. S. E. And. Very good. Okay, what about number three? Oh, ow. Uh, uh. Wow, nice. Yeah. How about number four, Sunny? Uh. Wow, well done, Sunny. Okay, now let's make a sentence using each of the word. For example, the bakery is open at 8 o'clock in the morning. What's your sentence, Sunny? Yeah. I think the shop of the book is closed. Very good. Okay, now you can actually make your own sentence. Just like angry example. Okay, my, ma my mom was angry because the house was very dirty. What's your sentence? My dad is angry. Nice. Why is your mom angry? Because my body is, is dirty and has mud in the body. Oh, I see. Okay, now next we have your new. My mom bought me a new pair of shoes. What's your sentence? My mom is going to shopping. She is my... The clothes that she wear in morning. Very good. Nice, Sunny. Great job for that. So for that, Sunny, I'm going to give you another three stars. Wow, nice. But Sunny, let's review your sentence, which is the last one. Instead of saying, my mom is go shopping, you can say, my mom went shopping and mm -hmm. she bought Art, a dress uh, yes. that she wears this morning. Mom went, my mom went shopping and she bought a dress that she wore this morning. Very good. Okay, why do why is it that we don't say is go? Okay, because aside from the grammar, which is wrong, we don't say is plus the main verb. Okay, so if we want to say shopping or going, then 
we say when. For example, my mom what? went shopping. And also, Sunny, since it all happened in the past, so we use the past form of the verbs. Went, bought, and wore. It always agree with each other. Okay? Okay. Very good. All right. So, Sunny, you did a great job today. Let's count the stars by three. Three, One, six, three, three, nine, nine, twelve, fifteen. Wow, you've got fifteen stars in total. Do you have any questions, Sunny? No. Great. Thank you so much for joining our class. I hope you learned something. Have a good night and see you next time. Bye, Sunny. Bye, teacher.